it like it rolls through. Like, oh, it's not how that works. I kind of hope he doesn't. I hope he does not pull a Falco out for his. Yeah, but saying. to be honest, uh, so they played uh, Fox in the melee, if I remember correctly. Yeah, but it's still like the raw understanding of space yeah. usage. What to do it. Yeah, you can you can see already that like, unlike normal snake gameplay, it's uh, a lot more in your face. I'm not gonna throw grenades at you endlessly. I'm gonna actually like yeah. box with you, which is very hard for Bobo. It's gonna be a very annoying matchup for him because because of that sideband and how often PK Chris will use it and can use it. Yeah, the thing is, the thing is you have to like. I, I think how it works, you have to like condition him to like know that you want to box him, and then you can start throwing in some some grenade stuff. Yeah, that's I have never a seen that. Good dare to I have never that. seen that happen before. That was insane. Ooh, attack! Attack was, into a punish. That was actually that was wild. such a great tech. Oh, and he gets behind on the cross up. He's still alive. Snake's a little bit of a big boy. Shout out! He, da he downered the downered the uh, TK Thunder again. I think Elton would fail Stockholm going to Bobo. <laughs> Yo! That conversion was actually wild. If he had st sticky him down there, that'd have been sick. Oh, that was nah, so we, good! We it's, uh, he does that a lot. He does like, uh, but his normal setup for that is uh, drag down up there into up. I think it's up smash. Maybe it's up smash. The last hit of the jab. Getting it again. <laughs> Canceled for Oh! Oh, that was mad good. Oh! That kills! Oh my god. We're both a very that good was, lead right was, now. That was some mix. That was terrifying. Yeah, that's terrifying. Chris does that a lot too. He does the, the PK Thunder to, to like mess with you off stage. And if you try to if you grab ledge, he'll often hit himself to cover with PK Rocket inside stage. There's one thing I, with Nessus I've never seen. Peach Chris is the only one I ever see try to use like uh, pull so much. It's it's kind of crazy and like I, I've seen it hit a lot. It's usually better as an edge guardian option, which is kind of crazy. See, it's so hard. I, I don't like this situation because like normally snakes in the lead, they're just gonna camp you with with projectiles. You can't do that against. He has Ness. to approach. Like you cover space with projectiles, but you definitely oh, oh. My Lord. <laughs> that fast that was mock ten. My, was, my win was a fucking spoofing. He wanted it. He wanted that. <laughs> I wonder if there's like something we haven't thought of yet that's like a punish to him daring the PK Thunder like that. Like I want to probably not because he puts himself in the free fall. Yeah. So I, I don't know actually. Maybe people oh, almost reads the roller. If you like PK Thunder, like jumps into a PK Thunder and lands on the platform, you can cancel it earlier. And maybe get a punish off of the dare. But it's a, it's a solid option to beat out the dare. Oh. Back air, magnet back air. It's gonna Very bad position for Bobo right now. I kind of like that too. Notice that PK Chris, he didn't commit to sending the PK. Oh. Dude, coming. Here he, he goes. He, he didn't commit to putting to sending that last PK Thunder all the way at him, knowing that he wanted to dare him. So he tried to weave the dare to hit him again with the PK Thunder. But you know what's going to happen now, right? Also. Kind of crazy. Yeah, Mark went on a run. Sorry. After losing his round one, uh, who was it? The Lemon. Game three. That's crazy. All right, here it is. Here, it, wait, wait, wait. No, no, we don't want to see this anyway. That's the worst color I've ever seen in my goddamn life. Why? What the hell? I like the purple. <laughs> I like the purple. I'm just gonna call it new lasers. All right, see, but now, now it's back to Projectile City. You gonna hold these projectiles? I don't know why he does this himself. I think the match was fine. Yeah, but he doesn't play Falco like that. He's been playing it for a month. I don't know what that means. And it's an NYPR player. Okay. Like, 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 come on. Like, I know Chris is good, but come on. If I'm Bobo. I'm trying to dog on Chris this game. <laughs> oh, absolutely. What the? I'll fair my back, my guy. Not I think the Ooh. best. 
the best Falco stuff. Oh, you didn't see it. Didn't, oh! You didn't see this before. I think the best Falco stuff uh, against Snake is the fact that, like, sometimes you just don't realize how high he can get. Like, you think you're safe, you're reversing up there, but he can cover. I think he's with an up air, up air, yep. to the top right there. Or you with a back air, too. Lasers I love neutral. <laughs> I love neutral zoners. Let's go. Down here for a good. I want to see him challenge that that recovery with the pepper or something. Wow, that yeah, crouch because he can reach, right? Mm -hmm. Especially now where he's behind, he needs it. Back here, okay, back here, good. Needy back here. I want this game to even, but I know that one cutscene will make the game. I mean, uh, not even, but the cutscene. What cut scene. Hell was that up to? So we call the one month Falco. Back there. I almost didn't get that. It's pretty even. I'm here for it. <laughs> oh my god, that was a very big call out. No, that, that call out was if you pull grenades at like B reverse, it's gonna it's gonna clap you up. Oh, so gonna take. Good good call out for Bubble as well. Same situation again where Pika Chris is gonna need to start pulling things out of out of the hat. Or else he's gonna become very, very unfortunate, especially against Snake. Great on Smash. Oh. Game's even. Falco's up Smash is mad good. This is like, yeah, yeah. What one nair, one grab, one up tilt will even this game up instantly. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yep, up there it is. Oh, the grenade! Shout out grenade! Yeah, no, no, no. He went for up tilt there. What you need to do is go for grab. You go for grab so you don't explode the the grenade. Grenade. Oh, that's gonna kill. Wow, grenade the MVP of that match. That yeah. was kind of ridiculous. Oh, it's supposed to be dangerous. Huh? Supposed to be dangerous. No. Where? He probably did. Yeah. That means Swixy Suarez. Wow. Oh. Swixy yeah, Tom dude, ah, dude, I, I, I swear that matchup was just a little bit of matchup inexperience, obviously, but Who? like, uh, uh, right there, like, Chris, Chris and Taco was perfectly fine. Mm -hmm. He just was doing things where he'd do like Nair, and instead of going for the grab, he went for up tilt, which is real, mm -hmm. but because you get a frame one grenade, and it's not like a, like a tight combo, it's just frame one can get in there. He popped the grenade, so he went back to neutral. Whereas if he just if he grabbed off of the, the nair, he can now mix up and not have to explode the grenade. Yeah. So this See what already I'm about? Mm -hmm. didn't commit to the to the peaky and, and they got him in there. his head. Yep. This is already a very big lead for Chris. Oh, that's gonna hit. Oh wow, that I don't think he meant to do that on purpose, but this is not looking too good. Reading the roll, he wanted that back throw. <laughs> Try to put yourself on the ledge, like, so that, uh... Back air. Thunder. Wicked Flash, actually. Oh, the hits. It's so dumb. I actually, I actually like that idea, too, because if he thought it was PK Thunder, like, in mission, and just and a buffer dare... His YouTube is so good. Looks like Bo didn't know when it was going to, obviously, like, pop, you know what I mean? Great. This is really good for, for Bobo right now. Keep him right off stage, right where he needs him. Bobo just got a lot of extra credit off of that edge guard. Let's Went go. from 4% to 119. Hell yeah, no. He literally got that stock off of keeping him on the ledge and then calling out his snap to the win. The snake today. experience, baby. Oh. oh. No, that would have been absurd. It would have been a lot of damage. It would have been up till up air, up air. Or up till forward air. I mean, up air, forward air.
This music is gonna make me stab my eardrums. I like this music. I like. Maybe it's my ADHD just like. <laughs> yeah, maybe. <enjoying. laughs> uh, I Foster love. The back airs. Bubba trying to find intricate ways to get in. It's like Bubba's doing like quantum physics while <laughs> while PK Chris gets to just be like, I'm gonna side bag it in here. Here he goes again. That was that's, a great down smash. That's the second time he down smashes recovery. He's like, if you want to like hang out right next to ledge, you're gonna. Play stupid wanted, games, win two rewards. Yeah. He wanted to pressure shield because he got the C4 on shield there. Wow, that was, that was so good. Oh, God. That air dodge is so tight to not get blasted there. Oh, good. Oh, that was punished. All right, here we go, here we go. All right, thank you. All right, even game three. Let's see. Let's see how it makes it. I think biggest adjustment I'd like to see from Chris is not getting clipped hovering near ledge again. Best problem is also like, that's just a nest thing in general because you go for things like uh, where you where you're, when you're recovering you let you let your upbeat go and hit them while they're shielding and oh my god. That was a different punish, but actually same same like. Uh, but terrifying it equally. Oh, that was a great conversion. That also comes in combos in the up smash. I'm surprised he didn't go for it. If Bobo's the other- Oh, that's oh. gonna kill! Oh! Oh, he's alive. Sorry, the sparks got me. Oh, this is intense. This kind of scary. That's a hard position for Bobo to be in. They're swinging. Oh my- Oh, this is gonna be really hard for PK Chris. Yeah, that's it. Wow. That was mad good. That was a, game that was was a hell great of game close. three. Oh my goodness.